Okay, guys. Welcome back to my channel. It's Mandy. Today is the moment you have all been waiting for. You guys have been asking and requesting for Joe to do a change in chat with Lakari, who is the Annabelle Gives Hugs orangutan doll from Ashton Drake. And our dear friend Diane from Lindy Bloom Nursery sent us some happy mail. And in that happy mail was an outfit just for Lakari that is too perfect. I pulled it out and I showed it to Joe and he immediately went and got Lakari and was like, let's do it. So without further ado, I'm going to let Joe take over. You sit down. Hi, everybody. Remember, no curse words. <laughs> I speak like a sailor, so if one slips, I apologize, but there's no cats to trip over, so... Alrighty. He was in the hallway a minute ago and he tripped on a cat and cursed. <laughs> Here we have Lakari, and I know a lot of people have been commenting, not sure how to spell the name. The way I always spelled it was L. O-K-A-R-I But I don't mind any of y'all spelling It's nice Anywho It's my monkey I've never done one of these before So sorry if I'm not given All the fancy details You're gonna be fine Just <laughs> Unvelcroing this Pink polka dot uh, onesie. I don't know what you call it. Two piece. It's a no, romper. it's not a two piece. It's a romper. It's a romper. It's okay. a romper. Come on, you got it, Lakari. Flex, yeah. Ooh, Lord. I've never done this before, so you're gonna be fine. I'm sure I'll be fine. I'm also just trying to be careful. I don't want to accidentally rip out any of this fur. I'm going to try to get comfortable over oh. on my side of the bed over here. Oh, there's Kaizen. Let me free Kaizen from his... his... Anywho, out comes the footsies. There's Kaizen. Wee. Wee. <laughs> see. Sorry. Wee vey, I'm about to fall off the bed. Oh, okay, here we go. I will sit here with Kaizen. Not used to sharing a stage. That's a stage I'm willing to share with you. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just uh trying to make sure I got that. Anywho. So, you need to put the onesie on first. The white thing is the onesie. Alrighty. So, here we got. And so, and show it to them. Bananas for data. <laughs> Let's see. So, so you need to so you need to unfasten the bottom of the onesie. See how there's little mm. fasteners? Yes, little banana colored buttons. One, two, three! Ha ha ha! And then you just put it over her head. There we go. Arms up, yeah. It's alive! <gasps> Alright. Arms up again, yo. 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 Oh, oh. Hopefully they can't see me lounging over here. I don't think they oh. can see me. This oh. is me every morning. <laughs> Just trying to get my shirt on. Half asleep. <laughs> I'm like lounging on the side of the bed with Kaizen. It's my little guy. It's my little boy, cuddle baby. He's in my arms. While we're watching daddy. Oh, come on. We got it. Oh, oh, oh. It's caught on her thumb. It's caught on her thumb. Oh, See? Okay. See, it's caught on her thumb. There we go. Making progress. I'm not a complete failure, just for the most part. Oh, hush. I got it. Pull it over her little bum bum. Sorry. Alrighty. 
her hair so sweet. And she's got a little hat too. I saw that. Oh, what I was going to tell you earlier. Yesterday I was at work. I was in the produce section picking. I had to get a case of organic bananas. So I turn around and what's playing on the radio overhead ain't no hollaback girl. You're about to put them on backwards. See the tie? The little tie is in the front. Ew. So this I go. Is bananas. B A N A N A S. Exactly. <laughs> I grab a case of organic bananas. I turn to one of my coworkers while I'm carrying it over to put it on my palate. I'm just like, is bananas. B A N A N A S. <laughs> and then I turn around and see that there's two of the uh, warehouse supervisors coming by. And they're both just staring at me. One of them is cracking up. <laughs> The other one, I'm assuming, has never heard the song or forgot about it because he's looking at me like I'm absolutely insane. Oh, yeah, you got to get them over her little, um... And, of course, I'm having a hot flush. Oh, my goodness. Got to get the thumbs I'm not out. even the one filming, and I'm having the hot... Not that you will have a hot flush, but... Oh. Hey, it's caught on her little thumb on her foot. No, see. Oh, it got recut. Yeah. It's totally different than dressing a reborn. Thumbs. Oh, thumbs everywhere. <laughs> Bananas. For data. Wonder if they can see me. Uh, I, uh, uh. Yep. Very faintly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yo. Hello. And then look at the little hat. It's got the little black top like a banana. All right, come on. <laughs> oh my gosh, let me get up. Hip hop I monkey. Want to see. I want to see what she, oh my gosh, she's so precious in that. Oh, you guys, look at her. She is ready. For her diss track against Marigold. <gasps> A diss track against Marigold. Wow. What, 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 what? <laughs> she is adorable. Oh my goodness, I love it. Bananas for Dada. I'm gonna pop some tags on the got $20 in, in my, my pocket. pocket. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, this is awesome. <laughs> oh, wear your granddad's clothes. I look incredible. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. That is adorbs. That is adorbs. Diane, we love it. We love oh. it. Oh, you guys. So, she also sent Marigold her pajamas in the correct size so she did so she had accidentally sent me her granddaughter's pajamas so she did send me marigold's pajamas in the correct size but you guys the airport contacted me because um stormy left something on the plane so let me show you guys i've got it right over here let me show you guys stormy left something on the plane and the and they contacted me. Here we go. And unfortunately, the airline had something to say to Stormy. Um, they put a note in the book. And when I had to go and claim the book that she left behind, unfortunately, this was left. Enclosed is Stormy's book that was left on our plane. Please speak with her about her behaviors and manners. The entire plane had to be cleaned. Thank you, CPK Airlines. I had to apologize. I had to write a check for damages. So we're not going to talk about that. But here is the plane. I mean, here is the book that Stormy left on the plane. F is for Fart by Mr. Smelt It and Mrs. Dealt It. It's my kind of book. 
that is your kind of book. I think we should read it to everybody with Home is where the heart is. Home is where the fart is. Come let us fart in the home. There is no art in a fart. So a fart may not be artless. Let us fart an artless fart in the home. Ernest Hemingway. I'm not quite sure of the validity that he actually said that. Oh, this is where I crack them off. A is for antelope. Antelope mostly live in vast grasslands, and their farts sound like out-of-tune brass bands. Oh my gosh. Look at the cloud coming out of the antelope. B is for badger. Honey badgers. So fierce it's not funny. Bees hide from their farts and lose their honey. Lord. C is for camel. Some camels have one hump and some have two, but all camels have farts that smell like poo. Oh my lord. Uh oh. I think this story has possibly uh, summoned somebody. D is for dinosaur. Dinosaur means terrifying lizard. Their farts were like a repulsive blizzard. <gasps> Stormy! My gosh. E is for elephant. Elephants are smart, large, and so wondrous. Even when they let one rip, it's quite thunderous. Oh my gosh. We've got some help here. F is for ferret. Ferrets dance when they are feeling afraid. And when they toot, your nose will be dismayed. <laughs> G is for giraffe. Giraffes can stand up to 20 feet tall. Their farts smell like rotting leaves in the fall. Oh, that's lovely. Diane, I can see why this was Stormy's book. H is for hare. A male hare is called Jack. A female Jill. When they pass gas, you'll tumble downhill. Me. <laughs> I is for iguana. Iguanas fart, and it's pretty funny. It's funny unless the farts turn runny. Oh my god, <laughs> this fuck! Oh my gosh. J is for jaguar. Jaguars hunt whilst being very stealthy, but their toots stink more than what seems healthy. Oh, look at the kitty farts do stink. Kitty fart. I can one hundred percent tell you, kitty farts stink. K is for kangaroo. Kangaroos live in groups called mobs, you see. And when they pass gas, they do it with glee. <laughs> L is for lemur. The name lemur means spirits of the night. They take delight in having a stink fight. Well, that's my house all the time, especially now that Stormy's here. M is for manatee. A manatee is an aquatic beast whose farts smell appalling, to say the least. Look at that manatee. He looks very proud of himself. Ooh, yeah, you ever fart in a tub? Hush! It comes out very condensed. Stop! N is for narwhal. Narwhals are unicorns of the ocean. Their butts make a noxious bubble potion. <laughs> what? O is for otter. Otters are playful and stay up all night. Their farts smell like fish. It isn't all right. P is for pelican. Pelicans can't fart. Their butts are poor, but they drop poop down below as they soar. Oh, Lord. Q is for kingling panda. Kingling pandas eat bamboo for their snacks, but watch out when their flatulence attacks. <laughs> I am stupid. I just now realized this is an alphabet book. It, you just... Wow. Okay. <laughs> R is for rhino. Rhino's farts will knock you right off your feet. The stench of their toots really can't be beat. Wow. Well, wow, I really see why this was Stormy's book. S is for sloth. 
Sloths, they hang around taking life easy. They're too cool to have a butt that's breezy. Okay, apparently the sloths are not farting. No, he, he's working on it. I mean, they move slow. Oh. T is for turtle. Turtles make great ninjas. We all know that. Just keep your distance when their butts go splat. <laughs> oh. U is for unicorn. Oh, no. Unicorns have rocket blasters, you know. They blast great big farts and away they go. I've been told there's also glitter. <coughs> V is for vervet monkey. Vervet monkeys. Look, you guys, there's a uh, a typo. Vervet mokies. Vervet mokies play all day and all night, having fun and farting to their delight. Oh, Lord. W is for whale. The scale of this whale is rather immense. Your nose will surely know to take offense. Uh, yeah. X is for x-ray tetra. Most fish don't fart, x-ray fish included. They don't have to wonder which friend tooted. Oh, well, okay. You gotta find something, yeah. Why is for yak? Darn barking spiders. <laughs> that's what That's what we used to say, is darn barking spiders. Why is for <laughs> yak? Yaks wonder at a high elevation. Their farts smell like a stinky gas station. Z is for zebra. Oh, sorry, guys. Zebras pass gas when you give them a fright. That's a real stanky take on a fight or flight. Jet propulsion. That's the end. Well, Diane, I can see why this is Stormy's book. And I think that um, considering who I'm married to and considering my little red-headed daughter over here, I think we're probably going to have to buy a copy of this book ourselves. Oh, no. <laughs> Stop that. Never. Okay, guys, that's it for today. Really sorry that this video took quite the, um, the gassy turn, but, oh, let's bring, let's bring Lakari on one more time so you guys can see her in her super sweet little outfit. So, guys, she's also, she's good for Sunshine Yellow Saturday from Becca's Happy Place. She's wearing yellow. So, all right, guys, we will see you next time. Until then, take care. Take care of each other, and we love you. Bye.